Well, everyone, jaw tooth again. Looks like we're going to have another great video for you. Uh, she's coming back from the vet. I had to take my dog to the vet in Winchester, Ohio. And right when I'm leaving the vet, I hear the, the train. They're on the radio talking about pumping their airline up. So they're headed eastbound. They've got, a, uh, I believe, an empty rock train. They're going to be going all the way out to the east end of the line. And they should have some cars uh, for Winchester Ag to load grain. And they should have a couple cars for Peebles to load railroad ties. My doggy is right here. She's not feeling good. Uh, she's got a fever and her ears got some problems. But I just got back from the vet. They gave her some antibiotics. Uh, they gave her a, a shot, a steroid shot. And the train will be by here just any time now. So go ahead and start the video, son. Here we go. Here we go. Pulling hard. This is going to be a good one. Wow, that was a good one. They were really booking through there and pulling hard. That was awesome. That was a good train. Man, <laughs> that was a good train right there. Wish my dog felt better. She's in here. There she is. Well, at least she heard the train. She's just not feeling good enough. She's got a fever and everything. Okay, let's go catch them again though. I gotta get the dog home in a little bit. But wait, there's more. We got the train coming into Winchester now. The grain elevator is way over there that's kind of hard to see because all the trees the trains could be coming from that way right down there now it's interesting because there's some cars there's some loaded cars sitting over here on the spur for the grain elevator i'm not sure how many is over there there's a few of them they've got a few loads over there can't believe that they're that they're doing all this work with only one locomotive. They got a lot of faith in that locomotive. It's a GP 15-1. And they're right down the tracks over that way. They'll be here in a minute. Okay, so I'm in Winchester here. I can't decide the best spot to film the train. So I came over here by the switch. Uh, the train's coming from that direction. They've got a conductor over here somewhere. I think he's at the end of those cars. So those are loaded cars. There's five of them right there. They've got to pick those up and set off seven empties. That's a strong locomotive.
Three steps released. Got another rail fan here, I see. He doesn't get on YouTube though. He's not familiar with my channel at all. Kinda interesting. I've talked to him before, but he doesn't get on the internet. They're pulling the loads off the siding right now, off the green spur. Get a nice picture of that truck right here. <laughs> That's cool looking.
then they'll reverse back this way again here in just a minute. All right, here they are, shoving back towards the spur. That is a strong locomotive. All these cars on this little slope right here. I've got some videos of the GP49 stalling out on this grade. Three to a tie. So they coupled on to those last two cars on the end. All right, we're getting ready to go again. Right. They just made a cut and they're gonna pull about three car lengths. They're coming back this way again.
Back on the main again. So now they're gonna shove back this way and they'll tie back onto those cars over there so they can continue east. All right, so they're gonna couple back on here. coupled up here getting a little stretch there and now they got three step all righty well I guess that's it here for Winchester and they're going to continue east uh, they got to take those rock cars all the way out there to Plum Run and then those two guns those got to be dropped off at Peebles so I guess I'm going to head on out of here. Maybe I'll catch them going through semen or something. I don't know. Anyways, thanks for watching. It was pretty cool. But wait, there's more. There always is. And I'm over here at Mount Zion. There's two tracks right here. And they're going to leave those, those grain hoppers over here so they can catch them with a westbound run. They'll leave them down at the other end, at the east end. I'm at the west end of Mount Zion. I think this crossing is pretty cool looking with these signals and everything right here. Those signals. Old Norfolk and Western color position lights. They bagged those, oh, somewhere around 2007, right around that area. That's probably when they did it.
Here comes the train. shooting into the sun. I try not to shoot into the sun, but sometimes you can't help it. I want to show those signals. Look at that. Those are cool. Too bad they're not in use still. Yeah, I've ridden the 611 steam, steam train on this back in the late 80s and another time in the early 90s from Cincinnati to Portsmouth, Ohio and back. The good old days. The last year that they ran the steam train on this line was 1994. Alright, that was pretty cool. Thanks for watching everyone. But wait, there is more. And now I'm east of uh, Seaman, Ohio. Just east of it at Tranquility Pike. This is one of my favorite places to film right here. I love this curve. And now the track kind of snakes around that way. The rails are actually kind of shiny hasn't rained here much since last week so there's not much rust on there just a little bit see and there's the cows down there in that big muck mess too many cows in such a small area it really does stink too <laughs> a lot of cows in there they'll be happy when summer comes around Got good grass growing and it's dry. All right, here comes the train from that direction right there. All right, this time I'm gonna be on this side of the train. So we'll have both sides of the train now. They'll be coming around that curve right there. Oh, I had somebody want me to give a shout out to their brother, but you didn't give me your brother's name. Uh, somebody said that their brother who has autism watches all my videos and he's got a birthday coming up in May. So I wanted to give him a shout out um, so if you see this leave a comment let me know what his name is and we'll give him a shout out train of beer in just a minute all right i hear him coming
There's Freddy. Don't see him very often, only on the, the rock trains. All right, was that awesome or what? That was pretty cool. I love watching them on this spot right here. You got all these curves, not much traffic out here. Let's see what the rails look like, because I know that they're really shiny now. Yeah, look at that. Real shiny there now. All right, everyone, thanks for watching. Had a pretty good day at the railroad. I'm gonna get my dog home. I know she's feeling a little bit better. She likes riding. So that's one thing, helps keep her happy. Get my dog home and give her something to eat and, and drink and all that stuff. And have another look at her ear. I got some antibiotics that the, um, the vet gave me. I gotta give to my dog twice a day for a while. Okay, we'll see you later. If you have time, watch another video. Every view helps my channel. There's Sophie. Hi, Sophie. Poor dog. She is looking a little bit better. She's, she's chirping up a little bit. They gave her a couple shots there. Uh, they said just leave her here alone. So we'll give her antibiotics and she'll get better. She likes riding, so that's good. Poor dog. She's really old. She's almost 13 years old.